Welcome back to SolidWorks tutorial. Today we are going to design a simple sketch ladder in SolidWorks. Now it is used for carrying the object from one place to another place. And uh, in this video, I will show you how to design a structure design in SolidWorks. And now later we apply the material on this ladder and we also discuss about the how we use build build command in solid work so let's see how to create the sketch ladder so simply select the file now select new and uh, then select part then ok and uh, make the background to plain white so select plain white and uh, make the 3d sketch on the top plane so simply select and make it 3d sketch and now click on top plane and uh, make it normal and from this mid plane make the center line so simply select center line and uh, from this point make the center line up to this and uh, make the two lines from this and uh, also make the line to this and now again make it horizontal to this line to this line so simply select this point select this point press hold shift key and now select this point press and uh, make it along x axis and again select this point and uh, select this center line point and also make it along x axis then ok and the the gap between the center line to this this line is 800 mm so select 800 mm then okay and now same this also be 800 mm then okay and uh, overall length of this line is 5600 so click make it 5600 then ok and uh, this line also be 5600 so click and uh, make it 5600 then ok now we create the vertical line of the ladder so make the line from this to so select and uh, from this point to this point and uh, the gap between this point and uh, this line so select a smart dimension and this line is 700 mm then ok and uh, again make the line from this point to this point now again select the line and make it from this point to select line and uh, make it from this point to this point and uh, make the uh, smart dimension the distance between both this point is 700 mm then ok and uh, make the uh, smart dimension between the two point it also be 700 then ok and now make all the lines connecting these two lines so select this and now select the line and uh, select up to this and go to the smart dimension and from this point to this point is 700 then ok and uh, from this point and uh, this point make it 700 then ok now make the line and uh, drag up to this line now go to the smart dimension and from this point and this point it also be 700 so all the gap between this line is 700 
now select this point and this then okay and uh, later we apply the structure member to this sketch so simply exit the sketch and uh, go to the build mesh tool and now select a structural member and uh, we apply the structural member to a square tube uh, a standard iso type square tube and the size will be 80 uh, into 80 into 5 and now select the group so first of all select this line and uh, now select select this line and uh, now select the new group and select all the horizontal lines so select separately all the lines then ok now we apply the structural member to this sketch and it will be a structural design so so if you want to trim this cutout this portion to this body so simply select the trim command go to the trim and uh, select the end trim and body to be trim means the body which want to trim from this body so simply select i want to trim this body so select this body and uh, now selected separately all the vertical body so select this body this and separately selected all this body now select this it will be selected but takes more time to select then select and now select this last one and uh, selected the trimming body means from this body to trim this part so go to the select the this and select the both structural member so select first one and select second now it will be selected and uh, trim from this position so select then ok now it will be trimmed from this a structural member of both the and now we apply the end cap to this ladder so simply if you want to apply the end cap so simply select the end cap and uh, select the parameter so select this face it will be selected and uh, the thickness will be 5 mm and uh, if you want to make the fillet so simply click on corner treatment and now select the fillet of 3 mm then ok and now select on both this face so simply select this al this also be selected then ok and uh, also we make the extrude cut from this surface because it is used to holding the ladder from the surface so click on this face and uh, select this face and uh, make it normal then ok and uh, go to the lines 3d sketch now select 3d sketch and uh, select the line and from this point to to this point 
and now select this point and uh, also connect this point now we apply the dimension to this so the exit the sketch and go to the smart dimension the length will be 77 mm then ok and uh, this length will be 65 mm then ok and uh, we make the extrude cut so make it through all so go to the features and now select extrude cut and uh, extrude cut up to through all it will be selected now select this sketch and uh, take it reverse direction then ok it will be cut from this portion and uh, now it is used to holding this holding on this plane or surface to hold the ladder on it it will be cut from this face and uh, after all if you want to apply the belt bead on this ladder so go to the weldment tool and now select belt bead and uh, we select the weld geometry and uh, first of all select this face and uh, select this face and we apply the belt bead of radius 10 mm then ok and uh, now select the tangent propagation it will be selected all the corners of this structural member then ok and it will be selected now we apply the belt bead to this structural member so it, it is the symbol of building parts of two two body to connect each other so it is used in building so and uh, we apply the belt bead to on the face so simply select the belt bead and now select this face and uh, now select this face and uh, select it tangent then ok it will be selected so we apply on the on the surface the of belt bead so it takes more time you apply on all the connecting these two parts building and uh, now we we apply the material on this ladder so simply and if the belt bead is not seen so simply select hide and so and uh, the last option is selected view belt bead and click on it it will be so the belt bead which radius is applied uh, if i untick this now it will be not seen this belt bead on this faces and if you uh, you tick this and it will be seen over this face to uh, which where apply the belt bead on the to a structure design and uh, after all if you want to apply the material so simply go to the appearance and now select the chrome and uh, i prefer chrome plate so it's good looking on this ladder design so simply drag and uh, select up to this part then it will be selected and and now over make the color some dark so simply double click on chrome plate and uh, make it some dark then ok now we design the ladder in solid work i hope you like it thanks for watching